<clears throat> uh, good evening, Mr. Chairman. My name is Zach Walls. I'm a sixth generation Iowan and an engineering student at the University of Iowa, and I was raised by two women. Zach Walls was born on July 15, 1991 in Marshfield, Wisconsin. He was born through a successful artificial insemination to his mother, Terry Walls. His sister was born in 1994. Both Zach and his sister have the same anonymous donor and are full siblings. In 1995, Terry met her partner, Jackie Reger, and together they have raised both Zach and his sister. Zach Walls gave his monumental testimony in front of the Iowa House Judicial Community on January 31, 2011. At this period of time, the Iowa House Judicial Committee was trying to add an amendment to the Iowa Constitution, making gay marriages illegal in the state of Iowa. I guess the point is that our family really isn't so different from any other Iowa family. You know, when I'm home, we go to church together, we eat dinner, we go on vacations. Uh, but, you know, we have our hard times too, we get in fights. Walls makes a logical and emotional argument by drawing parallels between his family and what a typical straight family is. Wall makes a connection with the audience by noting on the fact that his family does what every other family does in this country. There is nothing different between his family and others. Family comes from the commitment we make to each other to work through the hard times so we can enjoy the good ones. It comes from the love that binds us. That's what makes a family. So what you're voting here isn't to change us. It's not to change our family, it's to change how the law views us, how the law treats us. You are voting for the first time in the history of our state to codify discrimination into our constitution. A constitution that but for the proposed amendment is the least amended constitution in the United States of America. You are telling Iowans that some among you are second class citizens who do not have the right to marry the person you love. Wall speaks to the logical part of the audience by using the words codify and discrimination together. With the use of these two words together, it brings more meaning into the speech. The words make it more understandable on how the amendment would be a step back in the fight for equal rights besides a step forward. Sexual orientation of my parents has had zero effect on the content of my character. Thank you very much. Walls asserts himself with the audience by giving the audience the truth about his content of character and how his parents' sexual orientation has nothing to do about it. His tone of voice used here convinces the audience that he, a son of a gay couple, is no different than a son of a straight couple. Since Zach gave his speech, he has spoken on many shows, including The Ellen DeGeneres Show, The Late Show with David Letterman, and The Daily Show with Jon Stewart. Zach has also written a book titled My Two Moms and started an organization called Scouts for Equality, which works to end the gay ban on both gay scouts and gay troop leaders and boy scouts. No.